praise the Lord. Welcome today to the word for today with myself here, Jason. And today, the 9th of April, the word for today is new life. I'm going to read Revelations chapter 1 verse 18 from the King James Version. This is the words of Jesus. He said, "I am he that liveth and was dead, and behold, I am alive forevermore." Amen. And have the keys of hell and of death. You know there's something amazing about new beginnings. A new beginning. Uh, new beginnings bring fresh joy, hope, restoration and new life. Like a newborn child that cannot be contained in their mother's womb. So is the newness of life of God. The resurrection of Jesus Christ was the manifestation of the power of life in God. Whatever you may be facing, know that the Lord is more than able to cause newness to come bursting out in your life. Praise God. Just like uh, the book of 1 John states, let's read the 1 John 5 from verse number 11. I'll use the New King James. It says, "And this is the testimony that God has given us eternal life, and this life is in his son. He who has the son has life." He who does not have the son of God does not have life. Hallelujah. If you have Jesus you have life. So the solution to every problem you have is in the life of Jesus Christ. As you fellowship with God and get into his word, new life will spring out. Victory is yours. As Jesus is alive forevermore, even so your testimonies will be eternal. This is the good news. Just take this confession right now. and and say i confess that i have jesus in my life therefore i have new life springing up in me daily amen praise god uh i will be back again tomorrow with another awesome word remember to share this podcast with someone encourage someone bless someone have a blessed day amen